hi guys welcome back to my channel and today i just wanted to talk about overcoming your fears with going to the gym so i thought this topic was important because it's real and i think at some point all of us have felt that way um with feeling feeling awkward going to the gym it may be the most embarrassing to us because you don't want anyone to see you struggling you don't know if someone's laughing at you and for me in the beginning of my journey that was my mindset you know i was just like what if somebody's watching me what if somebody's recording me it was it was really scary for me i didn't know what i was doing as far as doing workouts but I think it was more mentally. It's me definitely a mental thing where you just let your thoughts get to you. You know, you could sit here and be thinking, oh, this person's probably recording me and talking about me when that person in reality is just changing the song <laughs> and literally just looking to be looking. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody's talking about you. And if they are, it happens. I don't know anyone that's not being talked about. You know, I'm probably being talked about at this very moment. I overcame my gym fear by just going. I went every day. The first week I went every day. And then after that, I ended up going five days a week and resting on the weekends. Um, so I think the more you start to go, the more comfortable you get. And you start to realize that you're doing this for yourself, you know. Um, so I would do 30 minutes cardio. I would do strength training. So one day I would work on just my arms. Um, the next day I work on my legs. So just switch it out. Try to make your workouts as fun as possible. Um, it does get easier though. I promise you it does. So I'm actually going to go to the gym. Uh, I got to get ready now. Um, and I'm going to do 30 minutes on the elliptical. I don't want to record that because I don't know how to record it or... I don't know how to record that. I really don't. And I don't want to be like, hey, can you record me? Like, that is so weird. So um, after I do my cardio, I'm going to show you guys some of my strength training workouts, what I do. Um, and I'll actually, uh, I actually use this Fitness Buddy app. Um, for me, that is my actual personal trainer. Um, that app shows me what workouts I can do and what muscles it's working out. So I'm going to show you guys that as well. All right, guys, I got my handy dandy sweat belt. <laughs> I watch too much Blue's Clues. But, uh, yeah, see you at the gym. <laughs> you thought that was funny? That's where the sound effect's gonna go. This is what my gym looks like. <laughs> This is where it got hard for me and my workout was the recording section. I was actually beside a group of girls, skinny girls at that, and I was just so worried. Like, what if they're talking about me? And then I said, you know what? What is this video about? We're going to do this. Let's just, let's go. I like to work my sides with this workout. I use a 12 pound kettlebell because that is all I can handle. And make sure you keep in mind that you do not need to lift the heaviest thing to get a good workout or to gain muscle. Um, take it easy and you will be able to add more on um, as time comes. The workout that I'm doing right now is called the Russian Twist, and this is a really good workout for your core. Make sure you are listening to your body when it's time to take a break, take a break. 
right here i was struggling i'm not gonna lie you can see the struggle in my face and i had to give myself a little pep talk in my head to keep on pushing and sometimes that's what it's gonna take as long as you keep going is all that matters make sure you drink your water Y'all, I'm nosy as hell. I don't even know what I'm looking at. But this is a prime example of what I mean when I say when people are looking at you and you think they're talking trash, they probably just nosy and just looking to see what you're doing. All right, so I'm going to stop right here and show you guys what I'm doing. All right, so it's getting a little awkward letting this video play out. So we're going to go ahead and jump into that next workout. Now this workout is what's gonna get rid of my chicken wings. And let me go ahead and give you a side view. Ba bam to show you this is what i mean when i say go to your own little bubble and do your own thing over here showing y'all this belt like sweat is dripping off of it <laughs> This is probably the most exciting part for me. Seeing my baby smile. When I opened the door, I was not expecting this. Oh. <laughs> yep, that's my child. <laughs> son just made it home from the gym i do have to wrap this video up because i have to get in the shower i have physical therapy within an hour so um i just hope this video was able to um encourage those who have that fear of going to the gym just showing up to the gym is is the beginning it's the it's the best part you know just showing up so don't don't worry about what people think about you no one can judge you for going to the gym and bettering yourself because at the end of the day everyone in that gym is trying to better something about themselves so just keep on pushing keep fighting um and tune the negative thoughts out that is the most important part tune the negative parts out find your bubble get in your zone and find some hype music and bust ass but thank you so much for watching this video if you haven't already please go subscribe to my channel and um follow me on this weight loss journey i love you guys Bye.